Welcome to greenscott.ca. What we're going to be doing is measuring up whether or not a lawn aeration wheel will fit this lawnmower. First of all, you use a plastic tool to pry off the plastic hubcap. Place that aside using a 916 ratchet or whatever ratchet's required to remove the retaining nut to take off the retaining nut. Once that's done, simply put the nut aside, remove the wheel, which is eight inch, as well the self-propelled cog. Ensure that you remember which way that goes back on. You're not gonna be needing it for the aeration wheel because we found that one aeration wheel, more than sufficient for pulling the lawnmower forward. What we do then is put your aeration wheel on once you received it. Prior to this, you're gonna have to measure whether or not these tines clear the frame or shroud of your lawnmower. You can see here, you got about an inch to play with. Prior to that, the best way to measure on an eight inch wheel is to measure from the axle center at the edge or base of where the threads would stop against the face of the axle. And you can see here that you've got six inches for clearance from the shroud where my fingers are. You know then that the aeration wheel is gonna fit because the radius is six inches. Once that's said and done, place your order. Put your lawnmower back together for now. Go ahead, mow your lawn. Have fun. Enjoy the summer. Thank you very much. Like, subscribe, and I appreciate your time.